speak to me like that. You don't get to tell me what to do! Are you going to let her get away with that? Yes, I am. She's right. No one gets to tell the Beaker girls what to do. Come on, Jess. Sean's not a bad man. He just loses his temper sometimes. Yeah, that's not all he's lost. Shall I call your taxi? No, it's OK. We'll walk. used to drive. She never actually had one. It was all in my imagination. Well, this one's yours. Well, I don't want it. Well, I, of course I want it, but I need you to respect me and my daughter. I do respect you. Then stop trying to buy us. I'm not. I just wanted to give you a present. Because I love you. I love you. Can we go now? Stay. I'm begging you. Sean, stop. I wanted to surprise you. Look, Trace, Jess. I'm sorry it all went wrong. It's all my fault. Stop it, you idiot. You're gonna get all muddy. I deserve it. I'm a clumsy idiot. But I want to be better. You make me better. Only you can do that, Sean. I'm trying. Please, if you'll let me. Okay, just get up before you ruin your trousers. Tracy Beaker. No way. You have got to be joking. Mum. I've never been more serious about anything in my life. <sighs> Tracy, I know I've made a lot of mistakes. And I know I don't deserve you. But if there's one thing I'm sure of, Tracy, it's that I love you more than anything in the world. I'd do anything for you, Trace. Anything. So, Tracy Beaker, will you marry me? Like I said, me and my mum, Tracy Beaker, are a team. We look after each other and we don't need anyone else. And we definitely don't need Sean Godfrey. Carly, Sean. Hello, you handsome devil. <laughs> oh, my little princess. Oh! Oh! Help! Help! Will you, will you... He thinks it's okay. Help! Will you no. just get him away? Get him off me! <laughs> my hero. <laughs> oh, look what he's done to me. Oh, it's fine, Carly. Sit down and have some tea. <clears throat> Tracy, where's my cake? Oh, here, Mum. I ordered it specially. So who would like a piece? Oh, I'm afraid we're all rather full. Yes, shame you didn't wait for me. We waited for ages. I'll have a piece, please, Granny Carly. <laughs> and me too. Oh, just a small one, please, Tracy. Darling. I googled this place. You won't believe what it's worth. Stop it, Mum. I don't want to know. I just want you to appreciate how lucky you are. Mum's not lucky. Sean's lucky to have her. Don't scowl like that, Jess. You'll get lines on your face. Carly, she's ten. Yes, it's an awkward age. I do remember. Oh, you, you were quite impossible. <laughs> I mean, no wonder I never found my Sean Godfrey. There aren't many men who will put up with that. <laughs> Tracy was a great kid. When I think of that, Fierce, funny, clever, loving little girl waiting by the window while you let her down again and again. Oh, so that's what you told her? It's what happened, Mum, every Saturday. Oh, so I see you've poisoned them both against me. You know, it's such a shame if it wasn't for your lifestyle, you could have had your own children. She did. Me. Cam gave me a home. Somewhere I felt safe for the first time in my life. 
So if you have one word to say against my mum, my mum, Camilla Lawson, you'll be the one standing at the window waiting for me, and I won't ever be coming. Now, let's all enjoy some tea, shall we? Nothing, Carly. Jess, are you all right? Jess. Sorry. Oh. oh, it's okay, Jess. Not your fault. Now let's get you to the bathroom. It's all right. Was I really that bad? I never said you were bad. Just not good enough. I'll get you a cloth. Jess, what's going on? I thought you were making more of an effort with Sean now. I am. Well, it doesn't seem that way. You've been sulking for days, giving him the evil eye when you think I'm not looking, and yes, I see you. Sean has been so good to us. Why can't you respect just one simple rule? He doesn't respect the rules. He's a cheat and a liar! What do you mean? Mum? I'm sorry. I should have told you before. Mum, stop it! Stop it! Please don't hurt yourself! It's my fault. I should have told you. Never, never say that. This is not your fault. Does Sean Godfrey make you cover for him? No, I just didn't want to hurt you. You haven't hurt me. Hello? Tracy? I begged her to take the Cadillac, but she said she wouldn't keep anything of yours. I can't believe she went through my stuff and found that phone. I can't believe you lied to all of us. I really thought Tracy was the one. She is. I love her. Then you've done a very stupid thing, Sean Godfrey. Shut me out. We need to talk. Talk to Justine Littlewood. Just let me in. 